I wanted to do a little project share video with you guys. Um, I joined Tony Craft Purge's clipboard, Halloween clipboard swap, and I am about ready to package it up and send it off. So I wanted to share with you guys what I made. Um, the requirements were, uh, let me get out my handy dandy swap tracker to tell you. Um, we had to make a clipboard, a dangle hanging off of the clipboard, a handmade card, a shaker embellishment, a memory dex card, a sweet treat, and a store-bought crafty goodie. So um, I decided to go with Doodlebug. I love Doodlebug, but I never craft with it um, because I don't know if other people love it as much as I do. But to me, the um, Halloween collections, you know, what's not to love? So um, I decided to use the um, Happy Haunting collection for my project and um, I tried not to get too too cutesy with it but um, anyways that was sort of my inspiration so let me share with you guys what I made it was make to receive to I did not make one for the hostess because she asked us not to send her one so I'm going to send her something else instead but um, I just made two of these so let me show you I think it just turned out so stinking cute um, the reason I did decide on Doodlebug was because I had hauled these little keychains from Timu and I wanted to use them. And to me, they just scream Doodlebug. So I sort of designed the whole thing around these little keychains because I just really wanted to use them. They're so stinking cute. Okay, so this is the front. Um, this is the back. So... On the front here, uh, there's a dangle, so you can unclip it. I just um, clipped it on there on the top, so this is what the dangle looks like. And again, I just think he's the cutest thing ever. Um, it's like this kind of rubber feeling keychain, and then I just put all kinds of little beads on here. This one says bat, and I've got a little jingle bell, a little skeleton, a pink spider, some candy corn, a little seam binding, and um, I just love how that turned out. So, so cute. Um, so that was really fun. And then for my shaker, I used this die from Tailored Expressions. Um, I got this a while ago. I don't know if they still have it in stock or not. Um, I'll look and see. If they do, I'll put the link in the description. But uh, anyways, I turned this into a shaker. It's a really fun Halloween tag. And um, I just used some fun colors. And I've got a little witch charm up here dangling off the top that I got. I got that from Monty, the polka dot pine cone. And uh, I think it turned out really sweet. So I've got that clipped on there. Uh, for my store-bought goodie, I picked up one of those treat jack-o'-lantern treat bucket dies from Timu and I um, put it in this cute little uh, bag from uh, Oriental Trading this little candy cane bag candy cane no candy corn bag anyways this little treat bucket and has all the dies I've, I've shown it in a previous haul video so I grabbed one of those and then this is my little handmade card all the cards are different um, so I'm just throwing that in there. It's a cute little handmade card. This little stamp is from CC Designs. And um, I used to be on their design team. So I have quite a bit of their stamps. And um, really cute little paper. This is Doodlebug paper. So that's my card. And then this is the clipboard that I made. And I did it with the ghost die from uh, KS Craft. And I put a little Your Fabulous little emblem down here. And both of them have that. And then I've got the little face. So really cute. So that's the front of the clipboard. And then the back is pretty heavily decorated too. Um, they it wouldn't all fit. I needed a pocket on the back. So I put this little pocket. This is the one that comes with the ghost eye. And then I've just decorated up the front here with some ephemera and some little candy corn and some tassels and charms over here on the side. And then this is my memory decks. And you guys, I just this little paper clip. Um, I am just so excited with how this turned out. Look how cute. I just love it so much. Um, so what I did was I used the um, cauldron die from My Favorite Things. I think it's retired. I don't think they have it available anymore, but um, you know, maybe you could find it on eBay or something. Um, and I turned it into a memory decks card. So I cut that out of glittered paper and um, puts a little bit of foam behind it and put it on a memory decks. I used this potion die 
from KS Craft, and I've got a mesh tool skirt. This is a ruffled trim that I got, I think, from Sparkling Ghoul. And then I used the Witch Legs, which are the cupcake toppers that we all got a couple years ago on Amazon. I think they still have them, and I think I've seen them on Timu as well. And so they're just like these paper Witch Legs that you can stick into cupcakes. So I used those. I put some bows here. And then I just loaded this thing up with buttons and pearls and rhinestones from Buttons Galore and more. And uh, you guys know I'm on their design team and they send me all sorts of pretty goodies to use. And so I have just loaded this up. I also stitched a few sequins on there with some French knots. And um, I just love how it turned out. I think it is super cute. Um, I even made one for myself because I just thought it was so cute. So I'm really happy with how that turned out. So that just tucks in uh, back here in the back. And... Um, just tuck it in right there. So I'm hoping and praying that everything makes it there safely. Um, you never know when you're sending things in the mail. And then instead of my sweet treat, I'm going to send this pin because it's Texas and it's 112 degrees here. And I'm pretty sure any food that I send is not going to make it there. It's going to melt in the package for sure. So I hope that's okay. I'm going to send a pin, uh, this cute little uh, jack-o'-lantern pin as my sweet treat. And I'm just going to stick it in here. And so hopefully the recipient will be okay with that and hopefully Tony will be as well because it is just so hot right now that I really think any food that I send is not gonna it's not gonna last in the package um so that is my um clipboard swap that I am sending um I had so much fun playing along thank you Tony for hosting I can't wait to swap everything out and watch all the reveal videos and receive my swaps I just love the whole process and um I really appreciate you hosting and um all that good stuff so I hope you guys are doing well and I will talk to you later all right bye